Hey guys, Phil here from jailbreakitouch.com. Today I'm going to show you how to how to jailbreak your iPod Touch firmware 2.1. Uh, so there's going to be a couple things you're going to need. You're going to need to download the Quick Pwn. Uh, just go to quickpwn.com and get the latest uh, get the latest application. You're going to need to make sure that your iTunes has also been uh, upgraded to 8.0 and that your iPod Touch is running firmware 2.1. So just make sure you click on have to click on help and go about iTunes. You'll see that it says uh, iTunes 8, and you're running software version 2.1. You also want to make sure uh, just to just to verify you can also go into your settings on your iPod Touch. Go general about, and you'll see where it says version. It'll say 2.1. So we'll just click on next. So keep in mind this is not upgrade. This, this does not upgrade your iPod Touch. All it does is just uh, it just modifies the the current uh, IPSW uh, so that it is uh, so that I can jailbreak it. Okay, so it shows that it's ready to go. It, it did find it. So we do is we click on next. We want to replace the boot logos. So what this does, this will automatically put your own, this will put like a pineapple on that. You definitely want Cydia and you definitely want installer. So click next. Just please ensure, there's going to be some timing here you're going to need to do to put it into DFU mode. So make sure that you're ready to follow the instructions once you click next. It's going to say wait for your, wait for your iPod to be in, uh, in recovery mode. It's going to say hold down the home button for five seconds. So that's your center button. Hold it down. Then it's going to tell you to put the power button down, so hold the power button down at the exact same time. Do not let go. And then it's going to tell you to release the power button and hold the home button. And by doing this, what you'll hear, uh, as you've heard in the background, uh, you'll get the default noises. As soon as you hear that noise, you can let go and you'll see that your screen now turns white on your iPod Touch. So while this is doing its thing, uh, once again, you can visit jailbreakitouch.com. As it stands, as I make this video, we are well over 12,000 uh, 12, members. All videos, all tutorials are free. Uh, the only reason you need to sign up is just if you have any questions or you want to post some stuff on the forum board, you just have to sign up to do that. We've got some really good moderators that are there. There to answer your questions, and I try to answer your questions as much as possible. So what'll happen is once this is done, it's going to it's gonna to go to your you take a look at the iPod touch here now. And it shows that it's downloading the jailbreak data. Download the jailbreak data. And now what it's doing, it is modifying the iPod Touch. It takes a little bit of time, but it's, once it's done, you'll have Cydia and Installer on there. Now what I do, I'll give you guys a couple things here. Um, once you get Insidia installed, make sure you connect to your Wi-Fi. Um, with Insidia, now I'm not here to advocate any any particular, uh, my personal preference for an application, but Insidia seems to be the one right now that, um, that everybody's using. Uh, there's not a lot in the installer as of yet. But with Insidia, a couple things you're going to want to get. You're going to want to download Winterboard. So go grab Winterboard. That allows you to modify the look of your iPod Touch. There's everything from icons to batteries to keyboards to menu bars. Uh, the whole system, you can now modify sound. They have dynamic backgrounds, so that's with backgrounds that change. You also want to get Make It Mine. 
that allows you to change um, to change the top portion on where it says iPod. You can change it to your name. So there's your new boot logo. So the apple, you're going to see a see a pineapple. So there's your noise again. That is iTunes. Uh, picking it up. So once it boots up here, you'll see. Once I open it up, sorry, you'll you'll see Cydia, which is the brown one here, and you'll see Installer, which is there. So that's it. So now you just make sure you connect to your Wi-Fi. Go to Cydia. Go to Installer. Um, play around. Make sure you get Winterboard. Make sure you get Makeup Mine. Um, there's a lot of really really great apps uh, that have not made it to the App Store that are sitting here on Cydia. Uh, make sure that uh, you go to the app store also and uh, you get some really cool apps that are on there. And you know, say if, you, if this is your first time upgrading to two point, anything above 2.0 or 115, you'll see that you now have the, the app store. And that's it. So visit jailbreakitouch.com and uh, thanks for listening. Have a great day, guys.